it's time to put the people in the course. Um, we've, spent, we've spent a long time working out what our course, what our units were, what our lessons were, what our collections were, building assessment and so on. But at the moment, that's just the content and the activities. There are no people involved as such yet. So the way to do that is uh, to go back to your home page. And you'll notice that um, it's all about classes and classrooms. Um, what we're going to do then is we're going to create a classroom. Uh, we are going to be the coordinator, the, the facilitator, the teacher. And now we want to invite our students to come into our class and engage with our OER textbook. Click on Create Classroom. You'll see it wants to know uh, what is our classroom called. So um, I'm going to give it a um, an obvious name. It's a mathematics class. Uh, in this case, it's the CSEC um, syllabus. Um, but because I run this course on various occasions, I'm going to give it a date so I can distinguish this class and classroom from uh, other ones that I've run before. So then I can push the Create button. And now it's um, opened up the little classroom and it wants to know, well, we've got the, the container to hold all the people, but um, where's the content? So in this case, I can, uh, rather than build from scratch, I've already built the course. So I'll click on choose a course. And in this case, here is our OER mathematics textbook that we've built in the other videos. Uh, select it and push the assign button and now you can see that when we look at our classroom uh, in the blue strip is all our um, statistics uh, and in the gray strip we can see the structure of the class um, to invite people though uh, what we're going to do is provide them with a class code and if you look in the top left corner um, every class has this unique code. There's this one. And what you'll do then is when students come into Guru uh, in, on the opening page, they would need to copy or at least have access to what the code is. Perhaps you give it to them. And then you would say to them, join a classroom. You would click on here. And this is where you would put the code in. Once they come in, they are enrolled. And then from that moment on, all their movements are tracked and we can see what they get up to.